the construction of the airport began in 2018 after SBC Uganda Limited, a joint venture company between Colas Limited of the United Kingdom and SBI International Holdings of Uganda, were permitted by Uganda government. According to Corporate Affairs and Publications Manager, PAU Miss Gloria Sebikari, carrying out of earthworks, drainage activities, powering of cement, and paving of a 3.5 kilometers runaway are almost complete, which makes the works 55% complete. She said that the construction of what will upon completion became Uganda's second international airport is part of various oil projects that residents of Hoima and Uganda at large will benefit from. Mr. Robert Mukombo, an official from Uganda National Oil Company UNOC, said oil is expected to be refined and exported at the airport where about 60,000 barrels of oil will be produced on a daily basis. Ms. Kawira said PAU officials will soon visit all the 171 villages in 10 districts through which the oil pipeline is expected to pass to Tanzania in a bid to establish a composition rate of their land that is expected to be affected. The exercise which is expected to begin this week and last for about three weeks will include opening of a bank account and signing of agreements. About 2,500 households and 3,792 people are expected to be compensated right from Hoima to Mtukula in Chotara district, according in Chotara district. Katende Chabasinga, reporting for TV Africa.